हेलो गाइस वेलकम टू द स्किल्स विजन और आज हम लोग खेलने जा रहे हैं हॉगवर्ट्स लेग्स फिर से तो लास्ट टाइम मैं हॉक्स मिड में था कुछ शीघ्र उधर एक्सप्लोर कर रहा था एंड मैं भूल चुका हूँ कि स्टेशन के इधर है जितना मुझे याद है कि मैंने स्टेशन मार्क तो किया था लेकिन मुझे मिल नहीं रहा है सामने ड्रैगन भी उड़ रहा है चलो चलो छोड़ो हम लोग अपने मिशन चलते हैं ट्रेड टू आइटम क्लोथिंग हेलो गाइस वेलकम टू दिस वन मिनट मैं स्टेशन का वीडियो देख रहा था ठीक है लेट्स सी बाद में पहले चलते हैं क्लास की ओर ओके रास्ते घर से नहीं है Revelio Bye and there he is Ye idhar se ki rasta dikha raha hai Wo track mein nahi aaye guys <laughs> बैग को चोरी कर रहा है आई विश दैट दैट वर्क Thank you. 
I guess let's follow. Lumos. What is Syria? There be classroom that I'm not even familiar How did you get on with those tasks? Madam Kagawa, I completed the list of tasks you assigned. Wonderful. I trust you became more familiar with your broom through the process? <coughs> yes, Professor. That's good to hear. Keep it up, and perhaps one day you'll have a spot on the Quidditch team. If Black ever permits Quidditch again. Well, with those tasks out of the way, let us get started. Glacius. Pay attention to your wand work. Well done. I'd recommend that you practice your new spell here in my... Before taking it out. Glacius. There you go. Catching on quickly. Nice. Revelio. Okay, so I have a brand new video. I have to see what is going on in the robot station. इधर ही आसपास में Hogsmeade, here I come. We could use a few more house elves in the Accio! Hmm. 
बोर्ड पे कुछ तो लिखना चाहिए Seems a pleasant enough little place. Revelio. Not saying I don't cast the odd clean now when no one's looking. Hello again, Mrs. Brottle. Hello, dear. Was there something else I could help you with? Where did you say I should go to harvest the hawk lumps and find the box of letters? In a cavern in the hills, just southwest of our hamlet. Defender. Who lived here? I wonder. Revelio. There's no telling what lies in wait for me in there. Here is the station. बाल बाल बचा भाई See if there's something you need. Thank you for your patronage. I shall hope to do business with you again. Thank you for your patronage. That's been a pleasure.
See if there's something you need. That's been a pleasure. यहाँ पे मार्क नहीं लगा है दिस शुड मेक अ मार्क हियर भाई चलो लेकिन अब मैं यहाँ से समझ जाऊंगा कि इधर एक घर है ना इसके सामने एग्जैक्ट है ये नहीं समझ में आ रहा था है किस साइड ready to learn a resto momentum the slowing charm it allows you to freeze objects or people in mid air simply complete a few tasks and then come and see me ये कैसे करना है एड ट्रीट टू एन आइटम ओके तो मुझे लगता है कैसे करना है ट्रीट करके मैं इसमें से ऐड कर सकता हूँ कि आई केम आउट नाइसली 
I should show Deke. Deke, where are you? Here? बाद में आता हूँ भी नहीं देख किधर है रिवेलियो I use the enchanted loom, Deke. Wonderful. Will I be able to weave even more powerful magic into my clothing with the loom? You will, by rescuing even more powerful beasts. For now, however, Deke suggests you explore the vivarium and get to know the beasts you've already rescued. Can I use the loom to enhance any item of clothing? The loom will only enhance clothing of a certain quality. Deke suspects you'll find more <coughs> valuable clothing as you explore. Deke also knows that some of the shops in Hogsmeade can provide you with a variety of clothing for you to enhance. Thank you for your help, Deke. Meet me near the ruins of Falbutton Castle. After dark, do not tell anyone. तो ट्रेट ऐसा ऐड करना था मुझे लगा कि उसके बिना किए भी होगा लेकिन बाद में मैं जान चल थोड़ा सा खेल गया मैं Nice to see you, my young friend. And your reading is the dragon. That's exciting, I suppose. Perhaps you're due for an adventure. Ladies. Professor Shah. Astronomy is not divination. You won't find the mysteries of the cosmos charted out on your palms or at the bottom of your teacups. Alas, the heavens remain hazy to the starry-eyed. 
Now, if you were to devote yourselves to persistent and painstaking observation, you just might catch a glimpse. With that in mind, please take your telescopes. Tonight we will be on the observation deck. Still don't have your own? You can't be the new student forever, you know. You can share with Mr. Takar. Here, I can adjust that for no, you. No, no. Bring it into focus on your own. Sure. The Indian. Hai. Now, I expect all of you to put in your stargazing hours outside of class. Is that clear? But, Professor, it's freezing out. Mere cold didn't stop the great stargazers of the past. Look only to the astronomy tables they erected throughout the highlands from which they gazed millennia ago on the very selfsame stars above us. Is that clear? <sighs> Dismissed. Oh, hello. I'm Amit. We met in potions class. I'm happy to report that we've yet to have any explosions in this class. Oh, hello, Amit. Nice to see you again. Did I hear Professor Shaw say that you don't have your own telescope? I have a spare one you could borrow for the rest of term. That's very kind of you, Amit. Are you sure you won't need it? I'm certain. It's my old one. I finally got my hands on the new Celestia Contemplor. You've heard of it, I assume? I mean, of course you have. It's only the pinnacle of all personal stargazing implements. But my old model's not too shabby either. Goblin cut glass, first-rate optical enchantments. Hate to think such a fine instrument is just collecting dust. Well, I... I thank you, Amit. Think nothing of it. Anyway, the telescope's in the storage room right underneath us. You can't miss it. I have some, uh, reading to finish on the lower deck. Come find me there afterwards and bring the telescope. There's something I want to talk to you about. Revelio. I'm trying to put off my stargazing as long as I can. Our meat thinks he knows everything. Even told me he can speak gobbledygook. Sounded like gibberish to me. I had heard about these odd stone tables out in the Highland. Perhaps that's what Professor Shaw was talking about. The perfect night for Amit. Where did you say that telescope was? Sitting in the storage room beneath the top deck, look for the smaller set of stairs on the main observation deck. Thank you. Of course. Hurry back once you've found it. This was his old telescope. <laughs> That's practically brand new. Ah, a pristine night for stargazing. Do not let it be wasted. I have the telescope. It's nicer than I'd expected. I would not offer a prospective stargazer a third-rate lunoscope. <laughs> But there is, um, something else. Yes, what is it? You remember those astronomy tables Shaw was going on about? It just so happens I've been reading up on them a little myself. <laughs> and it seems there may be one right here at Hogwarts. I believe we could use it to find hidden constellations. Ah, 
I had a feeling there would be a catch to that telescope. No, no. I, I certainly wasn't trying to bribe you or anything. But are you in? No one from the Gobstones Club will go with me. Said they'd rather get spit at by a stone than... Well, they are cowards. Let us get moving while the stars are still out. I'll show you how to use that telescope once we get there. I promise. All right, I suppose I can go with you. I hope it's worth it. It will be. Trust me, I have read practically everything there is to read about this. It should be brilliant. Shall we? The table is on a castle wall ahead. Look for a stone platform. Revelio. That doesn't quite belong. We'll know it when we see it. Onwards we go then. Lumos! Some say the locations of the tables were originally marked by centaurs Lumos. for ritual stargazing. Huh. <sighs> It is nice having a fellow stargazer to explore with. Happy to be here. It is good to leave the classroom now and then. It's not that creepy out here at night, is it? The Gobstones Club are... Here I am, charging ahead. Uh, why don't you lead the way? If you're sure. Hmm. A little foreboding. A few cobwebs and some dust. Nothing to be concerned about. Oh, of course. It's just not as tidy I'll as meet. I expected. Could I ask you something? Oh, um, certainly. Why are you so fascinated with stars? I suppose because there is so much to learn about them. I mean, there is plenty to learn about a lot of subjects, but astronomy seems limitless. Always something new being discovered. They are forever discovering new moons and stars. In fact, they discovered a new planet just 50 years ago. Where precisely is the table we're looking for? According to an old astronomer's chronicle I found in the library, it may be somewhere along the castle wall. Actually, that's all I wanted to know. Oh, very well then. Revelio. Revelio. More cobwebs. You don't think any spiders might be lurking about? Oh no. Not this close to school, I mean. Look, there's the table. I think you should do the honor. Revelio. The constellation should appear near the center of your view. As soon as you've lined up the telescope, we will be able to fill out our star chart. Stargazing is all about patience and precision.
I don't want to do it, bro. I don't want to do it. Amit, could I ask you something? Oh, um, certainly. Why are you so fascinated with stars? I suppose because there is so much to learn about them. I mean, there is plenty to learn about a lot of subjects, but astronomy seems limitless. Always something new being discovered. They are forever discovering new moons and stars. In fact, they discovered a new planet just 50 years ago. Actually, that's all I wanted to know. Oh, very well then. क्योंकि इतने सारे स्टार्स के देख रहे हैं हो गया। I was right about the tables. They really are gateways to the far stars, just as the book said. And your contribution was invaluable. Rest assured, you shall be credited in my memoirs one day. Thank you, Amit. I look forward to reading them. And I look forward to writing them. <laughs> This is only the beginning. You will find more tables like this one throughout the grounds and forest, all beckoning to be discovered by a worthy astronomer. And if I have ever seen one, it's you. Oh, and about my old telescope, don't bother returning it. You should keep it. That's quite generous. Thank you. You are welcome. It has goblin cut glass and a gobbledygook inscription. I'm practically fluent in gobbledygook, you know. It's all in the throat, really, gobbledygook, you know, and, and how you pronounce your R's. Um, anyway, glad our adventure was a success. I will see you soon. Ah, <sighs> <sighs> never do get tired of seeing the astronomy tower at night. What a view. तो मैम से तो मेरी बात हुई नहीं उधर मुझे असाइनमेंट देगी ना कुछ तो 
मंत्र मंत्र पढ़ाएगी Revelio. Revelio. Defender. Lumos. मैम चलेगी नेक्स्ट मिशन क्या है मैं गार्डियम लेवियो से सीखना पड़ेगा ओके एक तो गलती से यूज हो गया था वो हो ही गया मीट नेटी आफ्टर द डार्क मीट नेटी So where is Natty?
जो भी देख रहे डोंट फॉरगेट टू लाइक एंड सब्सक्राइब कर दो यार सब्सक्राइब तो करो यार लाइक भी कर दो यार प्रसाद हो तुम लोग लाइक कोई दिक्कत नहीं Handy resource indeed, your field guide. I'm most pleased to be included. Anything to do with the dark art should be avoided. It's too risky. Anything to do with Salazar Slytherin is worth the risk. I can't agree, and I'll not say a word more. I'm sorry. I won't give up. What were you and Omina speaking about? He's being ridiculous. Apparently, Salazar Slytherin had a secret scriptorium here in Hogwarts. Omina swears it was used for the dark arts, so he wants nothing to do with it. I reminded him that Anne needs a cure. This scriptorium could hold the answers we need. The dark arts do pique my interest. There's more to dark magic than people realize. The Gaunts know this better than most. Perhaps I've spoken out of turn. Ominous's family history is personal to him. I'd like to know more about it if you wouldn't mind telling me. I won't repeat it. Very well. But do keep this between us. Ominous learned dark magic from his parents. Are you familiar with the Cruciatus curse? What does the Cruciatus curse do? It's known as the torture curse, Crucio. It inflicts intense, excruciating pain on the victim. Apparently, his parents and older siblings had no qualms about casting it on muggles for sport. Ominous described the sound of the victim's cries as horrific, so the first time he was asked to cast it himself as a child, he couldn't bring himself to do it. As punishment, his family cast it on him. The anguish was so bad that when asked to cast it again, he relented. I have repeatedly assured Ominous that he did what he had to, but he still hasn't forgiven himself. How horrible. Poor Ominous. He was only a child. He shouldn't blame himself. After that incident, the rift between Ominous and his family only grew. That is until I came along. Every moment he isn't at Hogwarts, he's with us in Feldcroft. Ominous trusts me. And more often than not, he winds up listening to me. I'll remind him of that when I follow up about the scriptorium. Watch for my owl. I'll have news soon enough. I'll make Ominous understand. He'll change his mind. That's it. Revelio.
You can't imagine how inconvenient travel was before. I wonder who lives here. <laughs> oh, I do miss the bustle of business. Hello, Madame Beaumont. Good news. I was able to clear out Ranrock's camps. You cleared them out? How? It was harrowing, and they dug in their heels, but I managed. Oh, I wish my brother could have done what you did. Perhaps he'd still be with me now. I'm especially grateful. You did for Bardolf what I could not. You saved our hamlet, my young friend. This will not be forgotten. I fear for other hamlets, truly. Ranrock and his lot are unlike any goblins I've ever seen. What do you have for sale? What are you looking for? Thank you. Sincerely. Marvellous. I could always use more of thee. Thank you for passing through. Revelio. Revelio. I need to find some enemies. I will learn Guardian Levius. Revelio. It won't be long now before we find another repository. Lumos. Coming back this way. Where did you go? Simon tool finished. Glacius, defender, incendiary. Nice try. Confringo! You call that spell casting? Glacius! Defender! I won't rest! You're dead! Incendio! Confringo! Yeah. Oh. 
Okay. Now turn. Akio. The Bolsar. Glacius. The Binder. You've one less follower, Ranrock. Mission be complete, okay? Oh, कुछ काम का भी चीज हो गया. Revelio. अरे वाह ट्रेड मिला इंस्टेंट म्यूजिक फोकस कर नीचे और अच्छे मटेरियल्स हैं एक तो मैंने उड़ा के फेंक दिया रेवेलियो Revelio. Chalo. Next quest. Guys, let's end this. I've always said that travel broadens the mind. Wonderful to see you again, Revelio. I've completed my assignments, Professor. Pleased to hear it. Professor Weasley will be too. I'll be sure to let her know how well you're coming along. Thank you, Professor. Professor Hecate tells me she taught you Levioso, so you should be ready for a more advanced levitation charm. Wingardium Leviosa requires a bit of concentration and a nice graceful wand movement. Let's see you try your hand at it. When executed correctly, 
You should be able to pick up boulders as though they were sprigs of sneezewort. Professor Garlic, a moment of your time? The plants are resting, so now's as good a time as any. I was wondering, what made you want to teach herbology? How lovely of you to ask. I've always had an affinity for greenery, so this situation is a bit of a dream come true. After graduation, I was thrilled to be asked to step in for my old herbology professor. He'd had a slight accident, you see. Oh dear. A shame for him, but it worked out well for you. Hmm. Well, he never cared. I mean, really cared for the plants, and they could sense it. Oh, you'd be surprised how perceptive a plant can be. At any rate, the trouble began one day when he cut into a Wigan tree. Unfortunately for him, its leaves were hiding a bow truckle. You may recall the marvellous creatures that resemble a twig. The little beast gouged the professor's eyes quite fiercely, but terrifying, I'd imagine. Uh, likely for the professor, too. And that's when you took over as the herbology professor? Well, not quite. After three weeks at St. Mungo's, my predecessor regained a tiny bit of his eyesight. He insisted on returning to the greenhouse. Within a week, he had, he claims by accident, kicked a Chinese chomping cabbage, so it was back to St. Mungo's for him. What a string of bad luck. Hmm. Well, I felt awful for him, but I dare say I felt a bit more sympathy for the cabbage. Upon his discharge from the hospital, his indifference to plants had turned to utter disdain. He lost what little patience he had left with a particularly temperamental venomous tentacula, and, well, his resulting leave of absence continues to this day. I'm glad everything worked out as it did and that you're the herbology professor now. Very kind of you to say. I do love these gardens and helping my students grow. Huh. Lovely speaking with you. Have a wonderful day. Oh, and remember, be kind to your Wigan trees. यार यहाँ से सोच रहा तुम जब प्लांट्स प्लांट मिलेंगे यहाँ पे तो प्लांट भी नहीं लगा रही रेवेलियो चल जाने की जरूरत है क्या गवर्नमेंट रूम में वो ये भी कर सकते थे क्या होड ऑन होड ऑफ मुझे मालूम नहीं था
ऑक्स में डूबते हुए चलते हैं Sometimes it seems all roads lead to Hogsmeade. Welcome. Do you let me know if I can be of any assistance at all? A wise decision. Thank you. I hope to see you again. Farewell for now. Are you not here, man? Handy resource indeed, your field guide. I'm most pleased to be included. So guys, ये वाला trip हम लोग next के लिए रखते हैं. तो keep watching skills हो जाए. मिलते हैं next video में with new mission. Netiku बुला रही हैं हमें castle में, Pal Barton castle में. Let's see. Thanks for watching. Peace.